Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to Ray's World. What a great day it has been. I hope you have had a great week. I had a great week last week. We are doing our Weedy Wednesday. I've got my box of, of pennies from the bank. Got to tell you a quick story. I went to go pick these up on uh, Thursday or Friday last week, and I went to my teller. My tellers at my credit union are wonderful. Best people ever. They all know me. They know I coin roll hunt. They know I do, do YouTube videos. And they're, they're so wonderfully accommodating to me. As you know, last week I went in and I got an entire box of 2018D pennies. Uncirculated. Cool. Still, still have that box. Um, I go in this week and the teller is in the vault. And she's in there for a while. And I'm thinking to myself, I uh, hope she's okay in there. It, it was legitimately seven, eight minutes before she came back out. She came back out and she brought me this box and four fifths of this box are customer rolls. And then she's got two rows here, 10 rolls that are 2018 uncirculated. She said to me, the only thing we have are uncirculated pennies. She took this box, she emptied four-fifths of the uncirculated, put them in the safe, and then she had a few sitting loose in the safe and she packed those in here. I cleaned them out, guys. Cleaned them out of circulated pennies. All they have right now are uncirculated pennies. They've got two boxes right now of uncirculated pennies. So I'm gonna have to wait a couple weeks to uh, before I go back to that bank, that credit union. There's another branch in town. Um, I may go to them and start getting from them. But I thought, man, I don't have a full box to go through this week. Let's go to another bank. So I work downtown and there's a large bank right downtown. I thought, what a great opportunity. Let's go in there. So I went in there. She brought me out a sealed box, as you can see. I already went through it. Do you know why? Twenty eighteen uncirculated Denver Mint. I was hoping at least maybe they'd be Philadelphia Mint, but they weren't. Denver Mint. So I'm putting that box back into circulation. Now I've got some of the other ones I had suggested from a, a viewer, thank you very much. Uh, keep some, sell some, throw them back into circulation. Do all three. And I thought that's a great idea. So I've got some of them listed um, for, for uh, pretty cheap on a marketplace and uh, we'll see how those go. If, if it's a week and I don't get any hits on them, I'm just gonna dump them back into circulation. I've kept, um, I kept 12, 12 rolls. I kept $6 worth. I'm just gonna keep them, I'm gonna put them in a the safe and I'm just gonna let them sit. That's my plan with my uncirculated. I've never seen pennies like this. This is unreal. Like for me to see this, pretty cool. So, we've got four-fifths of a box that we're going to go through. A little decaf tonight. It's been a long day. So we're going to do this one live. I don't have my glasses. I've got my magnifier here. I don't even know where my glasses are. I think every pair of my glasses are in my office at work. Great place for him, huh? Thank you guys so much for subscribing, for liking, for commenting. I really appreciate it. The channel is growing. There's a lot of shiny here. The channel is growing. It's not exploding. That's okay. But it is growing. We've done giveaways. Our 100 subscriber giveaway was just recent. Thank you for everyone who subscribed to help me reach that goal. Um, one thing I will say, if you watched last week's video, I hope you watched to the very end. I'm pretty bad at that. A lot of times when I watch a video, it gets to a certain point, I'm done. I've seen everything that I wanna see, and I turn it off. I would encourage you to watch my videos to the very end, because you never know when I'm gonna do a surprise giveaway. Intent. 
Okay, nothing in that roll. We're gonna do a time lapse as we usually do. I'll see you guys in the wrap up, unless I find something really, really cool. Here we go. two and three and even one roll had four Canadians in it. Like, too bad they weren't weeps. So we've got a nice haul of Canadians, but we are on our last roll here. There's another Canadian. 1968. Add that to the stockpile. There's another Canadian. 1977. Got a pile going. Not a whole lot of wheats. That's all right. There's another Canadian. That's three. 1989. Can we make it four? the last little bit of it. There's a gross one. This box has been a little weird. Definitely when they're customer rolls, you should probably wear gloves. This has been nasty. There has been hair. And not hair that comes from your head. Not just. Not just. Ugh. Been gross. Alright, that is it. Let me get these sorted out real quick I may or may not even cut Canadians Canadians 2006 is the newest I, I, I'm not even counting them I don't know how many there are I mean, it's nearly a roll. Yeah, 
And check this out. King George, King George the Sixth, 1950. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's another Canadian. Add that to our little stack right there. So we've got two, four, six, seven, eight, 2009s. They all look pretty good except for one. King George over here. How about that? You really can't tell from the front, you can't get a year. But if you look at the back, you can see right there. Get a nice one side by side. Can you see it? Yep. So it's 2009. It's pretty corroded. It's pretty cruddy. I'm going to toss that one. Because I don't want it mixed in with the rest of my 2009s. I don't want that corrosion to spread. All right. Coffee break. Decaf. It's late. Here is an interesting penny. The 1969. Check that out. Look at the wear. I'm probably not going to keep it, but I thought that was interesting. I mean, look, at it's just really on the reverse. Just worn big time. Toss it. Okay, let's look at our wheats. Here's our first wheat penny. Doesn't look too bad. 1942 plane. Let's get the book. I brought the book this time. 1942 plane. Something tells me we don't need it. We don't need it. But that's okay. It'll go in the tube. Here's our next one. We only found four wheat pennies. This one's pretty worn. For a 1954D. We've got it. We might not be adding to the book tonight. That's all right. Another worn wheat penny. Nineteen fifty-three plane. Got it. We need the nineteen fifty-three S. They're just cool. It'd be cool if they made a commemorative, commemorative wheat penny. Nineteen forty-six D. We need it. All right, we put one in the book tonight. That's pretty cool. All right, let's do one more thing. And this will be our outro. Let's get some shiny on the table. These are those 10 rolls in that box. So we're just gonna open them up. Thank you everybody for watching. I really appreciate it. I appreciate the community. I appreciate everybody who throws a like, thumbs up a video, everybody who comments on videos, interacts. I was on a live stream last night, or the uh, last week rather, and uh, lots of good interaction. I like it. Lots of pretties. Lots of pretties. But we're not keeping them. We're sending them back. Thank you again for watching.